Sorry about the delay. I'm trying to get everything set up. Let me get chat set up so I can actually read it. <sighs> Wasn't expecting to play in here today, so everything's unorganized. Trying to move my keyboard and mouse and everything. So one second. There we go. All right. So I was thinking maybe I should finish working on Eddie's thing. That way I don't stop and never finish it. So here we go. Should be able to see it in just a second. As soon as it let's there we go. Let me all right, tablet is hooked in because that's what I was doing last time. Oh, it's cold in this room. I think the cord's all tangled up. There we go. So many damn cords, guys. So many cords. And I still can't see chat. I just realized that I didn't hook up chat. Hold on one sec. Let me plug this key in. All right. One of these is my chat thing, right? I am on now. Here we go. Let me edit what it says for me. Alright, I am on now. Here we go. Let me edit what it says for me. Uh, no, not yet. I just got onto the computer. Uh, no, not yet. I just I'm a got white on the male computer. in my thirties. I grew up in a fairly poor family. Didn't inherit anything from anybody. Spent the better part of a decade in the military, and then left and started my own consulting firm which has become quite successful and has earned me membership in the 1% by pretty much any definition of the phrase. My lowest paid employee, nearly 20s, early 20s, only two years out of college, makes just over 100k a year. Right now, even though I could definitely pay him less, I bill him out of the rate that supports his cost and me plus the regional cost. My lowest paid employee, nearly 20s, early 20s, only two years out of college, makes just over 100k a year. Right now, even though I could definitely pay him less, I bill him out of the rate that supports his cost. And he is not 30 years old. He is not 30 years old. Yep, I just noticed that. My volume was really quiet. Welcome back, KKTD. It's muted now. So is this stuff real about him or is this like pretending? Oh, gotcha. Well, he seems okay. 
But he's really old. If, like, what they're saying in these is what he means, then I don't know. I'd have to do research on him. All right, let's get some music going. Do you guys want to request songs or do you want me to start the radio? Then he sounds okay. I mean, he sounds better than freaking Donald Trump and stuff. An opening two minutes to Mr. Vernon Supreme. Thank you. Gingivitis has been eroding the gum line of this great nation long enough and must be stopped. For too long, this country has been suffering a great moral and oral decay in spirit and incisors. Our country's future depends on us on its ability ah, to fight my freaking back. website thing just we messed can no up. Longer Hold on be a nation in indentured. Our very salivation is at stake. Together, we must brace ourselves as we cross over to the bridge work into the 23rd century. Let us bite the bullet and together make America a sea of shining smiles from sea to shiny sea. Now friends, some people will tell you that this mandatory toothbrushing law is about the secret dental police kicking down your door at 3 a.m. to make sure you brush. Friends, it is not. Some will mention the dental re-education centers or the preventative dental maintenance detention facilities. It's about none of these things. It's not about the... One sec, sorry. I gotta restart my thing. I can't see chat right now either. Firefox keeps messing up on me. If he keeps doing this crap, I'm gonna seriously switch to like Chrome or some shit. Seriously, sick and tired of it messing up. Thank you. Ginger virus has been eroding the dumb line of shining smiles and sea. Some will mention the dent a race of wind monkeys to act as tooth fairies. Friends, what this mandatory tooth question law is really about is strong teeth for a strong America. My name is Vernon Supreme. I'm a friendly fascist. I'm a tyrant that you should trust. And you should let me run your life because I do know what is best for you. Yes, I'm a politician. I will promise you anything your little electoral heart desires because you are my constituents. You are the informed voting public. And because I have no intention of keeping any promise that I make. Vote early, vote often. Remember, a vote for Vermin Supreme is a vote completely thrown away. I would like to take this moment to acknowledge uh, my mother who is in the audience here today. Please stand up, mother. Please stand up. Um, if you can stand up, please stand up. Well, she's going to try and stand up so you can acknowledge her. This, this, is, this is my mother. Uh, there you go. And five years ago this April, I gave her a kidney. My challenge to you people, everybody on the stage and everybody in the audience, give up a kidney. All right. Thank you, Mr. Supreme. Mr. Supreme, uh, welcome back. Uh, you, thank uh, you, sir. Like, like some of the other candidates, including uh, former Governor Romney, um, this is not your, shall we say, first rodeo. Let us say that. Um, this is not the first time you have run for president in the Correct. New Hampshire primary. Uh, and uh, President Romney has been accused, and I'm not sure <laughs> right. the other, Does kind of work with it. positions on different issues. Um, I'm uh, asking you right now, are, do you still stand by your pledge made in 2008 to provide a pony for every American? Yes, I do, sir. Free ponies for all Americans, one of the overlooked issues in America today. My free pony platform is, of course, a jobs creation program. It will create lots and lots of jobs once we uh, switch over to a pony-based economy. We'll also lower our dependence on foreign oil. We'll also be able to uh, turn all that pony poop economy. into methane gas and wonderful compost, so we'll be able to... Uh, re uh, up our soil that is being depleted by uh, agrochemicals, etc., etc., etc. And of course, the important thing to realize is that it is a federal 
pony identification program where you will need your pony with you at all times. Thank you very much. FBI, did you get it? Federal Pony? Or FPI? Yes. Sorry, I did it wrong. Regarding the ponies. Um, yes. Is that the only government entitlement program that you support? What other entitlement programs do you support? Just that one. That's nice enough. But I was in the, in the vein of uh, energy production, I'd also like to address... Is that my, a boot uh, on his head? I just figured out what it is. Uh, for it's a boot. Sources. It's not just uh, to run away from anymore. No, we have giant turbines that we're working on, and we will have lots of zombies, and we'll just sort of dangle brains in front of them, and then they will turn the giant turbines, creating energy to uh, wow. lessen the dependence on foreign oil in America. Here it's a today. freaking Thanks. boot. Just a supreme, your 30-second closing statement, please. Is this really serious? Like, is he really, like, is this real? My name is Vermin. My name is Vermin. Vermin Supreme. My name is Vermin. My name is Vermin. My name is Vermin. Yeah, vermin, I thought vermin, he was just Supreme. wearing some and type of weird vote, funky and hat. You can vote, and you can because most of the it's been close up like this, so I haven't to. seen and, the top. Uh, and my name is Vermin. And, um, okay, thanks very much for coming out today. Oh, one, one more thing. Um, uh, uh, Jesus told me to uh, make random Terry clothes. Random Terry, random what? All right, turn again. All right, okay, okay. <laughs> I have no idea what that was he tossed on people. But that was funny. Oh wow, this world. What is it coming to? Oh, wrong one. Oh, man. What is this world coming to? I mean... One thing, though, that I think about when when that happens or whatever is he sort of, you know, he sort of does have some interesting thoughts that I kind of almost agree with. Like, I really do think that we should be forced to, to find a way to um, not use so much gas, you know what I mean? I mean, I, I kind of like that. Like, I don't really think the FBI or whatever is the best thing, but... What was Cam Button Overlay? I don't remember what Cam Button Overlay was. You can't saw. cam button overlay was supposed to be what was the cam button overlay oh i remember it now i'll have to rewrite that note agree with him exactly I think that he did have a good idea about finding a way like not exactly his way but finding a way to make us not use vehicles so much try to find a way that we're not so reliant on gases and the energy that we use currently Because, I, I mean, this world really cannot support us, yet we're really not doing much about it to fix it. We're just like, oh no, we're gonna die. Oh well, let's just continue doing what we're doing. Mm. 
that's the 